to get gas. Oh, wow. Found an old church in the middle of nowhere. It's raining. And it stopped raining. The golden eagles. The golden eagles. Yeah. But this thing is how you leave your respect to the forest fairies. Those are really cold. Is that it? So by building these, you this is how you pay your respects to the forest. to the fairies. Mission accomplished. Hey fairies, now we've been here. Can't get over how much detail is like in the landscape because of the way the, the rocks are colored. Because you can be all the way over here and see so much detail and everything. who don't know you don't just eat oysters straight you add some tabasco sauce or some horseradish and lemon to it Ooh, that sauce. that's how you eat oysters <laughs> it's Lucy in the sky with diamonds <laughs> it's windy around here Distillery. This is the oldest one in Scotland. It was established 1830. <sighs> Hello, and welcome to today's program. Today we're going to be talking about the Scottish Highlands. I think this is Highlands. We're at a port tree in Isle Sky, climbing up to Climbing up to see some of these things. Seem like they are big rocks. It's referred to as the old man of Sklor. But the cool thing about it, despite the hike and the grilling conditions, is the scenery. The scenery is spectacular. Needless to say. Look at that. I don't know, I don't know what the vertical feet of change is here, but it's been pretty intense. Uh, let me explain. It's partially just because of the elevation. Because I've been at sea level for the past couple of months. So this is, this is pretty difficult, needless to say. Um, 
and partly because of the general conditions here in Scotland. You can see the angle that this is at. <laughs> it's quite steep, yeah. <laughs> but also, it, it rains every single day here quite a bit. <sighs> Making the ground just moss, essentially. Oh, sheep. Sheep boo. That does two things. It allows for scotch to be made, and it also allows for extremely wet conditions. <sighs> Even whenever it's not raining. So with that in mind, wearing Chacos was a good idea. I'd sleep here too if it wasn't so damn wet. Now what's our goal, Lucy? The table. Over there. I guess it's really more of a Look at the lines and the... Yes. The Check out the view. Yeah, I see him. Okay. I don't know if you can see it, but down there, there are lines in the lock. Like they're they're white lines. Where's my hand? They're right there. Um. This is partially why people say that Nessie exists. It's like, oh, the monsters in in the lock are moving. That's the monsters moving. And you know, with these things being so old um, and so deep, I don't really see why there wouldn't be something huge that just lives in there and never comes to the surface. Because if you're a fish, why would you need to come to the surface? Depending on your anatomy. At any rate, we're going up there. viewers we have made it to the table across from old man's what old man is store and this view has made the Scotland trip entirely worth it Weather's changing really quick, we gotta go. <laughs> okay, that's good. <laughs> I literally cannot get over how this place looks. It's just so spectacular. It's cool, it's a good thing Lucy's living here now. Uh, cause I'll be able to come back. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that! That's ridiculous. It almost makes me want to like the water. Almost. Water's scary. Ow! Ow! It stabbed me in the foot! Oh! Ow! It hurt me! It hurt me! Ah. Uh. It hurt me. It hurt me. <laughs> Something's happening. <laughs> oh no. It's a strap cut and a button cut in hair. Oh no. <laughs> 
but what we're doing right now, he told us that there's a webcam that always plays, so we're making my mom tune into that. Hope she'll be able to see us. Um, also, we got to hold on to the the castle bars that our ancestor, direct ancestor, Robert de Bruce actually touched because he was hiding in there. So the Scottish Scottish castles are castles that we're mainly for living in. <laughs> Mommy can see us. Oh, she, she says, can? She says, take that hat off. <laughs> <laughs> so now we are at Loch Ness. Um, there's no, no trip to Scotland would be complete without coming and seeing the loch. Sure. And I understand why they would why they would think there could be such a monster in here. There's weird currents. Don't make any sense. Super long. We're at the end of it. It's like super narrow. Like tons of narrow. It's extremely large via depth and length. Um what else? I mean those those are the recipes for lots of lore. I mean those are the recipes for um mysteries like that make sense and the recipes for monsters i firmly believe in bigfoot as a real being um so why not why not nessie i, I think it's definitely a thing so i'm not getting anywhere near it it's a cool place i mean as a whole scotland's been amazing right chris yeah, it's been beautiful like We've been trying to like not explore cities and just explore the great outdoors in Scotland. Definitely, I think it satisfies our it. Expectations, yeah. Not only that, but the the people have been really funny too. Like the guy at the castle spotted. <laughs> like the guy at the castle that we just went to. He was really fun. Um. And I've said before, and I don't know if I've posted that that video necessarily, that um, if you're going to actually explore a country, you might as well explore outside of the major metropolitan city things, because otherwise you're not going to see, you're going to see too much of a, like, adjusted, adjusted culture. Um, I think this really speaks for that, because Edinburgh is extremely different from all the places that we visited outside of it. And I like outside of Edinburgh way better than the inside of Edinburgh. Lucy! What? What? There's the yellow flowers I've been trying to get, trying to been, but trying, trying to see this whole time. Ugh. Oh. You want to step in the water? Do you have to, I can film you stepping in the water. I totally, I, I'll step in the Loch Ness water. Like Loch Ness water. Going in. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> that is, that's unbelievably cold. <laughs> in our hotel, they have live music. It's not bad, but the thing I want to focus on is behind me, there's a little old woman Knitting. <laughs> Knitting. <laughs> it's so funny. It's cool. Yeah. And now, now Lucy. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs>